John Bennett with Logic Pro X, and in this video, I want to talk about the two different ways to save your project. If you in new in Logic Pro X, you have two different ways to save. If you go save as, or the first time you save, you'll have this option: organize project as folder or package. So what I'm going to do is actually just let me just throw this in here. I'm gonna call this test, and I'm gonna do a package because I want to I want you to see what happens here now as a package it's going to take everything is going to look just like one little file one file actually it's not actually little that's becomes a problem in and of itself so let's look here at that test test boom so you're thinking okay well, what the heck you you don't get you don't actually get to see all the pieces behind it but if you right click and show package contents, this is where you get all the pieces of the project, the audio files that were imported and all of the pieces of the project. Most of these are, are empty. Notice that it did not pull in all of the loops and, and things from the Apple loop library. Um, you can do that but your projects will be massive. Um, the only reason you would ever want to do that is if you were sharing a project with, with another friend. For instance, inside the VIP member area, I'm, I'm saving the entire thing, entire projects for my members to actually open it up and have all the pieces. So I would say, copy audio files, all these pieces in here, include sound, library content everything so that when you guys open it in the VIP area you have a complete project because I can't assume that you have all the same pieces that I have and then also what happens is from that point forward all the pieces inside the project reference inside that package or that folder so back to the question package or folder I have decided that for me at least I want to go with the folder option because I want to be able to search on the pieces inside the folder um, at a later date and, and be able to grab those easily without having to right click and open package contents and all that mess. That's that's another, one of the reasons I'm going with the folder versus the, the package thing. And I will tend to want to keep my folders as small as possible because I'm creating a ton of remixes and it can get out of hand. Now, if you also notice, let's go back. I'm going to close this. I'm going to open back up the one I just ha was working with here. So I've got that project back open now. And another in another video, I'm going to show you, let's say that you have brought in all these songs, but you're going to want to use those in other remixes. It's not really handy to have those all buried in their, their respective uh, audio file folders inside each project. So I'm going to show you in another video how to put all of these processed audios in a central place. So that'll be a different video, but that's packages versus folders. I hope that shed some light as to how you can organize your projects. You'll just have to decide for yourself what makes the most sense, the package versus the folder. See you in the next video.